Aquaponic agriculture uses a controlled ecosystem where fish provide nutrients like phosphorus and nitrogen for plants. Plants in turn clean and oxygenate the water and serve as food for the fish. The new aquaponics facility in Stellenbosch University will be conducting research into aquaculture using four fish species and a variety of plants to determine how best results can be achieved. A direct benefit of the research is low income earners in Stellenbosch area will get an improved diet through the facility's feeding scheme for poorer communities in the area. This is actually our second aquaponics system at the university. We loaded the first um, research facility last year on this farm. Um, this one, there was a common friend um, who introduced myself with Yalpi Miller. And Yalpi had this idea in his head that he wants to, to give something back to the community. And he wanted to give a portion of his inheritance from his father to build an aquaponic system, but he needed some land. And he would also like the system to be usable, um, maybe for research purposes. And then we thought it's maybe a good idea to build it at the university, where students can benefit from the system. But, but the community can also benefit. We produce plants, crops, vegetables, and, and also fish protein that can go to the local um, NGOs and to supply food to the poor. So what we do here is we take, we actually got grow beds and all the vegetables growing in gravel. So what is happening, we pump the ammonia full water from the fish into the grow beds. In the grow beds is bacteria that converts the ammonia from, 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 from to nitrates first and to nitrates, so, which is of course feeding for the plant. Uh, nitrates is not harmful for fish at all and the fish gets back its clean water and the plants are happy. So, uh, it's, it's a form of symbiosis uh, we uh, it's process it's, it's all very natural um, contains a lot of living organisms working together to actually make uh, yeah and so I think the most important area of research really with the most unanswered questions is the economics behind aquaponics is it really economically viable and sustainable and on what scale should you actually do it to get to your very even point, what volumes we produce. So I think that is one of the first things which we will try to answer and it will take us at least one year to get all the sums and figures and financials worked out to be able to answer that question.